A federal court in Brazil allegedly banned a major TV and radio network from saying certain things about the country's left-leaning presidential candidate. The media outlet in question is the nation's largest conservative station. Chauvin Pan is a Brazilian media outlet with a TV station and reportedly the largest radio network in the entire southern hemisphere. It's also the largest conservative-leaning outlet in the country. On Wednesday, the media outlet reported that Brazil's superior electoral court ruled that the station is no longer allowed to say certain things about left-leaning presidential candidate Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva, the former Brazilian president who was convicted of corruption and spent almost two years behind bars. Terms the outlet allegedly can't say anymore include former inmate, ex-convict, thief, corrupt, and ringleader. NTD spoke with Rodrigo Constantino, a Brazilian economist and political commentator living in Florida. He says the alleged court ruling doesn't make any sense. It's, it's absurd. It's history. He was. He was arrested. He was convicted. He was guilty. And uh, we cannot uh, say that Lula uh, is what he is. So it's, it's censorship. Brazilian President Jair Bolsonaro and supporters often criticize the electoral courts for allegedly being biased and trying to rig the election. Constantino says Bolsonaro is, for example, not allowed to use speeches he gave during his presidency for his current campaign because the courts ruled it would be unfair and an abuse of power. And the courts supposedly even censor some businesses. A guy that sells wine and the price of the wine in his store is 22 reais. 22 is the number of Bolsonaro. So the, so the, the electoral justice is telling him that he's not allowed to advertise this price anymore. We also spoke with Joel Pinheiro, an economist and columnist for one of Brazil's largest newspapers. He says the details of the alleged court ruling against Chauvin Pan are still unclear. I still haven't read that decision. I haven't met someone who has read it. He also says that the electoral court has ruled in favor of Bolsonaro in the past, when media outlets accused him of being a cannibal. So they banned it also. You cannot call Bolsonaro a cannibal. Brazilians are set to vote between Bolsonaro and Lula in the presidential runoff elections at the end of this month. Reporting by Arian Pastar, NTD News.